the Enugu State Chapter of the All Progressives Congress, APC, on Saturday held its local government congress across the 17 local government areas of the state. A former governor of Old Anambra State, Senator Jim Nwabodo and several others described the exercise as peaceful and credible. In the Congress at Ude local government area of the state, the Director General of Voice of Nigeria, Von, Mr. Asita Rokichalku emerged as a delegate to the forthcoming National Convention of the Party. Okichaku was returned unopposed during the UD Local Government Congress, held at the UD APC Local Government Secretariat, 9th Mile Corner, Angwo, near Anugu. However, this was not without a twist as Nigeria's Foreign Affairs Minister, Mr. Jeffrey Anyema and his supporters conducted a parallel congress at a school field in the same council area. Two other national delegates, Mr. Charlie Chime and Maureen, and Asik, were also returned unopposed at the same venue. The Congress was attended by party bigwigs from the local government, including the APC National Vice Chairman for Southeast, Emma Nyukwu, and the acting women leader, Mrs. Obin Wofa. Members of the UD local government executive of the party were also elected during the Congress. They include Jude Enyadab, Chairman, Ochiello Pascal, Deputy Chairman, Ebupigu Felix Okafor, Secretary, Mabel Oo, Women Leader, and Sylvester Omnia, Treasurer. Reacting to his election as national delegate, Okichaku assured that he would use the mandate given to him to support the efforts of President Muhammadu Buhari to revamp coal in Inugu and improve infrastructure in the southeast geopolitical zone. When we came here before, we promised that President Muhammadu Buhari will revamp Inugu coal. We promise that President Buhari will revamp Inugu Anipshara Expressway, Inugu Port Harcourt, and Inugu Makude Expressways. Today, work has started on all of them. Also contained in President Buhari's docket is $50 million for a Inugu Urban Water Scheme. We will use this mandate given to us to improve infrastructure in the southeast and revamp coal, Okichakwu said. Making remarks, Inukwu, the national vice chairman for Southeast, lauded the conduct of the Congress in UD local government, stressing that the exercise is free, fair, transparent, and credible. Don't miss. Download Daily Post Android app and an unlimited free airtime he described all those who attended the Congress as very committed and trusted party men, pointing out that independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, security agencies and the media were fully represented.